If you would like to request a video, send an email to questions at newstitchaday.com. How to knit the slipped double chain cable stitch, English style. For this tutorial, you will need a pair of knitting needles, a cable needle, and a ball of yarn. Special thanks to our sponsor Lion Brand for providing today's yarn. Today we are using their Vanis Choice line in the color Olive. For this stitch you will need to know the following techniques. Knit, purl, slip stitch, cable 3 left front, cable 3 right back. This cable stitch is worked over 7 stitches on a reverse stockinette background. Row 1. Begin by slipping the first stitch purlwise. Then we're going to knit 5 stitches. Finally we'll slip the last stitch purlwise. Row 2. With the yarn in front, we're going to slip the first stitch purlwise. Then we're going to purl 5. And we'll slip the last stitch purlwise. Row 3. We're going to take our cable needle or double pointed needle and slip the first stitch off of our main needle and we're going to hold it in front. So this is our cable 3 left front which means that we're going to work our cable over these three stitches and we're going to only be transferring this first stitch over. So now we're going to knit the next two stitches off of the main needle and then we'll knit the stitch off of our cable needle. Next we're going to knit one. Okay, for this stitch we're going to slip the next two stitches off of our main needle with the cable needle and we're going to hold these in back. And this is going to be a cable 3 back. So now we're going to knit that stitch off of our main needle and then the two stitches off of our cable needle. Row 4. We're going to purl all stitches. Row 5. We're going to begin by knitting 2. Then we're going to slip the next stitch purlwise. Then we'll knit one and slip the next stitch purlwise. And we'll knit two to end the row. Row six. We're going to begin by purling two. Then we're going to slip the next stitch purlwise and then purl one. Then we'll slip the next stitch purlwise and purl two to finish the row. Row seven. We're going to take our cable needle or double pointed needle and slip the first two stitches off of our main needle. Okay, and we're going to hold those in back. So this is going to be our cable three right back. Okay, and then we're going to knit the next stitch off of our main needle and then knit the two stitches off of our cable needle. Okay, then we're going to knit one. Next we're going to take our cable needle and slip the next stitch off of our main needle and hold that in front. So this will be a cable three left front. And we'll knit the next two stitches and then knit the stitch off of our cable needle to finish the row. Row 8. We're going to purl all stitches. Repeat rows 1 through 8 until you have reached your desired length. 
and that's how you knit the slip double chain cable stitch. After a few repeats, your pattern should look like this. Want more New Stitch a Day? Check out our website at newstitchaday.com. New Stitch a Day is a Craftery Media production. Check out our other shows at fiberstory.tv and yarntripper.com. This video is licensed under a Creative Commons Attribution No Derivatives 3.0 Unported License, which means use it on your website, put it in your patterns, but please don't change anything.